Hey, as promised, I have an interview for you guys right now. You know, as we get closer to the carnival period, it's always a... Uh, the usual that we interact with artists some young some old some familiar, you may be familiar with some that you may need to get familiar with and today is like no other on the line with me um via zoom call we have an artist that i'm pretty familiar with he goes by the name of bangela oh bangela you there bro hey what's up nice. what's up happy new year happy new year to the whole of the ojo team and all those locked in. Yeah. Right back at you, bro. Right back at you. Now, um, the last time I would have interacted with you, I remember it would have been in uh, Bishop's Ansi High School when you performed the four, I think it was graduation ceremony or something like that. I remember you. I feel I don't remember you. <laughs> yeah. um, now, tell me, how has it been from then till now? Because the last time we would have interacted, we would have been able to talk in person, we would have been able to chit chat face to face. But now, because of the whole COVID thing, it, it switched gears as to how the entertainment industry reacts. How has it been then from now, boy? How are you dealing with it, boy? That's the first thing I want to know. How are you surviving, boy? What are you doing? Um, I'm dealing with it by the grace of God, mm. by the grace of the Almighty. And um, I, I started to be much even creative at this mm. time. This is the moment where it shows clearly if you're really an artist mm. or if you're not an artist. Because being an artist, you have to be very creative and innovative in different times. And now is the time that we have to show our great talent by being very creative. You all know the thing when it comes to technology. Sometimes it has failure, sometimes it has just work with you. But we are the OJ world, we are accustomed to working around and navigate through all the, the obstacles that may come away. Right? So, Banjale, back with us. Loud and clear. Yes, I am. All right, now. Yeah, loud and clear. Let's go back to exactly where we left off with regards to accolades because I said I know that uh, you would have copped the 2020 Young Kings Calypso Mona. What else have you ever accomplished yes. over the years uh, that you that you feel you could mention here today? Tell us. Well, um, I know at age seven I won a lot of Calypso competitions and I always had been copying in the first five positions in the Young King Calypso Mona before coming first. Mm. I have always remembered... Um, singing like in weddings and different things like that. I've traveled to Europe, also represented Trinidad in that aspect, in singing in different areas. Yeah. Mm. I've also been to the motherland as well. So I have a great repertoire and, um, and I'm, I'm very creative when coming to music. So I just only don't sing soca or calypso. I sing reggae, I sing pop, R&B, <laughs> you know. But, but out of like all the things that you also, sing, um, which one you feel is, is your... Like, is your passion? Which one you feel is your calling? Because, I mean, just like me, I like all genres of music, but there's always this one particular genre that, you know, yeah. hey, there's more comfort zone here. What is that? Any type of Afro-oriented music. Ah, <laughs> Afro. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> now, I, I know you're, you're speaking to us today because you have a new project that you've been working on that you're bringing forth to us. Tell us about this new project you have with us. Well, I've just recently released a new video, music video, for my new song, Tabanka for Bumper. Tabanka for Bumper? And actually, that... What? Yeah, Tabanka for Bumper. Tell me, what you're Yeah. <laughs> yeah, right? and uh, I've worked with... Uh, this song actually was written by my stepdad together with uh, one by the name of Emster, Alistair. And him and I worked together on creating this masterpiece. Um, the song was actually... Um, recorded at my music studio, Banjola Music Productions, mm -hmm. and uh, Mix and Master there in the lab as well. Um, I worked with um, Spine, um, together with college boy Jesse, oh boy. Um, who were very instrumental to bringing the creativity together in a video, mm. Tabanka for Bumper video, which is actually now on YouTube, and you know, it's actually making headways right now. Mm. Yeah. No, no. How did how did this how this song came across to you? Because I, I, I mean, it's kind of self-explanatory in the sense that you're seeing Tabanka for bumpers, which means you yourself going through that Tabanka stage, like boy, you know, loving Gordian and and flexing Gordian, and enjoy myself, that kind of vibe. How how did what inspired you the most to create that song? Now? Exactly, exactly. That is what it is. We are the spirit of carnival, actually. We the people. You know, and we would be reminiscing on good times like Juve morning. I saw everybody was would have been prepared, van launching and all these different things. So, you know, when you turn left and you turn right, when you go to the avenue, you realize, ask up, you know, everybody just going. 
Uh, which so there's a tabanka for carnival. There's a tabanka for the whining, the jamming, the reminiscing, uh, and mm. meeting friends and, and all these different things like that. So that's the reason this song came about. Understood. Well, without any further ado, introduce your song to us. Let's premiere it on the Ojo Soka Sumo. Let the world hear what this song is about and give us it. Go ahead. Sir to Bigo and Ojo World, I am Banjola and this is my 2021 contribution to Soka. To Banka for Bumpa. Angela, I like to tell you, boy, a little bit again, uh, I sort of tear up inside, you know, I sort of crying, you know, because you were telling you all the elements of the song in terms of the content, the music, the vocals behind it, no? it really gave that, that energy like, yeah, boy, brother, boy, this carnival thing we ain't having this this year, boy, a little bit again, I tell you, there's tears inside, you know, wow, well done, Bangela. Oh, that- Thank you very much. Never. No, no, tell us. I, I know you, you spoke about visuals and stuff. By when we can expect these visuals, we can't believe for this song in particular, visuals is really going to take this song from where it is right now to where it really supposed to be. Because only them people really yeah, feel that, that, that need, that tabankaness. The visual, the good thing about it, the visual is out. Ah, boy. The visual is out right now on YouTube. That we talking about. So just check it out. The name of it is... Right now on YouTube. Tabanka for Bumper. Tabanka for Bumper. Ah, oh boy. Yeah. And I also have a new song as well called Till We Meet Up Again. Mm. I'm going to be working on a new video for that one too. So that one is, that has really released as well. Till We Meet Up Again as well. That is another, that another kind of soca tabanka so, tune or that is a, what kind of tune is that? Yeah. So, well, it's more, I'm more hype. I'm more hype. Uh. Um, I, I don't know if my PR had sent that to all yes, yet, but it's more hype. Mm. Um, and it's more, it, it gives me a little hope. Even though, yes, we have to bank up a bumper, but they give me a little, you know, save all the wine for me, save all the jam for me till we meet up again now. Yeah. You know? Do, do, you know when, when we meet up again, remember, it's the first jam on your list. Ah, boy. I like that. You know? So that is that. that. You because know? that is how the bank is supposed to be. You go to the bank and you have tunes you listen to during the moments when they're crying, when they do some tears and snatching the nose and they can't take right. it no more. And then they start to motivate to tell you, you know, don't worry yourself. It go be all right. You will get back to where we're supposed to be. Yeah. 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 Well, goodness, Bangela. Thanks for sharing this with us. Uh, thanks for taking any time out of your busy schedule to ensure that you know the Ojo world gets songs like these. We appreciate it. Keep the music coming. Keep up the good work. Be safe and all the best to you and yours. Thank you very much. And same to the Ojo team. Right, Thank God you, no brother. Respect.